Yeah. Uh, you don't really seem like a science guy. Oh, yeah. I mean, you know, not, not here. Um... I'm I'm sorry. I'm so completely fascinated by this. What do you mean by not here? Not here at camp. I do that at home, and then here I um. You're a wise, wise cracking smartass. <laughs> uh, that's a little harsh, but uh... no. Okay, so maybe I was a little nervous when I arrived in an uncomfortable social situation, and I overcompensated a little bit by making a bunch of jokes. You played into it. Yeah, I mean, people kind of enjoyed the blasé Dylan. Uh, and do, do you enjoy the blasé Dylan? <laughs> Not yet, like, you know, whatever, man, it's pretty cool, it's fine. <laughs> <laughs> um, I like Dylan Dylan. Well, it's nice to meet you, Dylan Dylan. I'm Ryan Ryan. Well, actually, I'm let's get the fuck out of here, Ryan. Yeah, I like him. He's that makes a lot of sense. All good? All good? Oh, this place is kind of a dump, huh? Okay, when I was a camper here, it was barely working. It hadn't been used for years, and it took me a really long time, actually, to get this place cleaned up and looking the way it is. So, I'm sorry if it's not up to your standards, but I've been putting in a lot of TLC. Okay. 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 Let me get this set up. All right. Anything over here we can use? The power tools? No. Um, that's, Mr. H wanted more storage, so it's kind of how he lets me keep the station going. <laughs> gotcha. So, uh, how far does it go? Oh, um, well, it was designed just to broadcast to the PAs around camp for announcements and to, you know, portable radios and whatever, so I think the range is about a mile. How do you even know all this stuff? Uh, I just kind of picked it up. Hmm. The tech technical stuff has always been a little uh, hard for me to get a handle on. Well, if you like, I could show you the robes. Like a class? Yeah, it's easy. Like climbing. Sign me up, teach. Anyways, this thing's going to need a bit of a power up, um, but that's where this comes in. 
Dust magnet. It's supposed to be a signal booster. It's kind of janky looking, but it's worth giving a shot. So, we can actually talk to people with this thing? Yeah, well, it's not a two-way radio, so, um, you know, we can talk, uh, but then the best we can do is switch it over to the receiver and see if anyone broadcasts anything back, which is unlikely, but... Well, it, I mean, it is what it is, I guess. Yeah. So, what should I say? Uh, just, like, make it sound urgent. Okay. Hello, how's it going out there? This is, uh, uh, we need help. This is, uh, we are counselors at Hackett's Quarry Summer Camp, and there has been a horrible accident attack, some stuff bad here. We need your help. Uh, there is a swarm of bears, and they are everywhere, and there's these hunters, too, and they seem to be shooting at the bears, but also at us, um, which is not good, and a few of our friends are hurt, and um, we are in desperate need of help, so please, I mean, there's vicious bears, and uh, we don't know what to do, so please uh, come help us, SOS, uh, this is a, an emergency, S save our ship, come on down, please help us. Did I do good? Was that... Swarm of bears? Yeah. Herd of bears. Yeah, I've heard of bears. What? Oh my god. Alright, I, I guess I should just like switch this over to the receiver and see if we get anything back. Yeah, okay, yeah. I'm gonna keep an eye out while you do all this techie stuff. Okay, yeah, sure. Check it. I got a ping on the radio, but no response. I'm gonna head to the Wait, did he did he say lodge? I don't know. Two males in the radio shack near the cabins. Another couple unaccounted for. Copy that. Um out. Holy shit, they're talking about us. How? Because we just told them! On the fucking radio! Fuck! They know where we are, man. We can't stay here. Shit. Shit. Fuck. Hey, hey. Shit. Let's, let, let's stay calm, okay? Um, let's, let's go find Caitlin and everybody, okay? Okay, yeah. I wasn't sure, man. Fuck, what the fuck was that? I have no idea. Uh, Ryan? Is it a bear? What is that? Brian. Fuck. What? Caitlin, Abby, and Nick, they're coming up the path. Oh, shit. They're coming toward us. We, we, we gotta warn them. Um, what about the PA? Up top? Yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah, we can um, tell them to hide or something. Yeah. Uh... Oh, fuck, no. 
Oh, shit. Uh, the... uh, hold the button. Uh, Caitlin, get into a building now. Do not come up here. There's an animal outside the radio hut. Get, in, get into a cabin now. Go! Oh, fuck, dude. They're gone. Uh, well, we gotta do something, come on. We gotta kill it. It's not a normal animal, man. I don't think a gun's gonna cut it. Of course it is, why wouldn't it be? Man, I just don't think it's a good idea to go running out guns blazing against some random ass super animal. Well, what the hell else can we do? Well, if it's got hearing like a like a dog, maybe. Uh, I mean, we could we could play a really high pitched feedback loop and crank it to the max. And uh, I mean, it would hurt like hell, but. Okay, fine. Let's do it. Feedback thing. Hey, Dylan, just take a breath. I'm sure you can figure it out. Okay, yeah, right. So, there's something missing. I, what's missing? Attacking the cabins. Oh crap, it knocked out the wire. Okay, uh, fix it, I'll cover you. Is it safe? I think we're okay for now. We ran into one of those hunter guys. Ah, oh, crap. Yeah, chase us out of the lodge. I think we lost him on the way up here. You get a message out? I think so. Great. What the hell is going on up there? It just attacked us. Holy shrimp, you should have seen it. Dylan made some sort of crazy feedback loop and it scared it off. Ah, it was nothing. A feedback loop? Well, you know, I figured if it's like most animals, then it would have sensitive hearing, so... Caitlin, where's your gun? I lost it. One of the friendly locals wanted to say hi. What the fuck? Did she shoot at us? Who's there? Who was she? Should we follow her? Uh... 
Ah, oh, shit, Dylan, what is that? <gasps> oh my god! You're back. Looks like that's one less vermin in the world. Let's take a look once more. No cards means no reading. Simple as that. Keep looking, though. There are still cards to find somewhere out there. We spend so much time looking toward the future. It's easy to forget that the past holds secrets, too. Worth remembering that. So it's goodbye again. I'll be here. I'll wait for you. Is she like one of those hunter dudes? I don't think so. Should we do something? What can we do? She's dead. I mean, with the body. <sighs> That's Kaylee Hackett. Mr. H's daughter? I thought she went home with her brother. Kaylee. Yeah. I thought so too. Oh man. Poor Kaylee. Nick. You smell so good. You all right there, bud? Maybe dial it back a bit, huh? Fuck off, Caitlin. Whoa. Nick, what are you... I don't want to taste you. Hey! Come here, huh? Oh, Nick, what the hell? Oh, get off! Oh, watch out! I said get off! Nick? Let's get him in the pool house. Dry him off. <laughs> B. Shh. Just try to rest. I'm sorry. We need to be keeping a record of everything that happens for the police. Yeah, dead girl in the pool needs some explaining, huh? Easy, man. Maybe like photos, whatever we can. 
I've got a funny feeling that the cops are not going to want to believe any of this crazy shit unless we've got some hard proof. From now on, if you got your phone and you see something, take a photo or a video or whatever. Yeah. You okay over there, Abby? Look, why don't you look around and see if you can find anything to help make Nick more comfortable? <laughs>